The Boyle clan, also known as the O'Boyle or Macaulay of the North, has a rich history in Scotland and Ireland that spans centuries. The name Boyle is derived from the Norman town of Boville near Carn, and the family has a long-standing association with the Ayrshire area of Scotland. The earliest records of the Boyle family date back to the 12th century, with David de Boyville appearing as a witness to a charter in 1164. By the 13th century, the family had extended their holdings, through successful marriages, with Richard de Boyville holding the lands of Kelvin in Ayrshire around 1275. Over the years, the Boyle family played a significant role in Scottish and Irish history. They supported the cause of Mary, Queen of Scots, and later that of Charles I, suffering many hardships as a result. However, their fortunes were later restored when John Boyle of Kelvin was elected as a Commissioner of Parliament in 1681, and his son was elevated to the peerage as Lord Boyle of Kelvin in 1699. The family continued to hold prominent positions over the years, with David Boyle being appointed Solicitor General for Scotland in 1807, and ultimately being appointed Lord President and Lord Justice General of Scotland in 1841. However, the fortunes of the family declined with the sixth Earl, who bankrupted the entire estate through an ambitious building programme at Kilburn, and funding the erection of churches all over Scotland. The present head of the family and chief of the name is the 10th Earl of Glasgow, who succeeded his father in 1984. He still resides at Kilburn Castle near Fairley in Ayrshire, on the lands held by his family since the 13th century. The family seat is now visited by Boyles from all over the world, and the family has continued to play an important role in Scottish and Irish history. Today, the Boyle family has numerous descendants, and many of them continue to celebrate their heritage and family history. The family has also made significant contributions to the arts, sciences, and politics over the years, with numerous members achieving success in their respective fields.